Disgraced FBI agent Peter Strzok is scheduled to talk to the House Judiciary Committee on Wednesday behind closed doors. President Donald Trump, however, said Monday night that he wants the world to hear from the agent who hated him enough to reassure his lover that together they could keep him from winning the White House. The panel subpoenaed Strzok following the release of a Justice Department Inspector General report that revealed bombshell anti-Trump texts shared between him and FBI lawyer Lisa Page. Both Strzok and Page worked on the 2016 investigation into Hillary Clinton's emails and then later were assigned to special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia probe. Strzok held senior roles in both investigations. investigations.ONE centerpiece of the IG report was an August 2016 conversation in which Page texted Strzok saying, Trump is not ever going to become president, right? Right no. No he won't. We'll stop it, Strzok responded. Trump tweeted Monday night as Air Force One circled above South Carolina waiting for dangerous storms to subside. The hearing of Peter Strzok and the other hating frauds at the FBI and Dodge should be shown to the public on live television, not a closed door hearing that nobody will see. We should expose these people for what they are, there should be total transparency, he wrote. Share this article, share Strzok. A seasoned counterintelligence investigator was demoted this year from Mueller's team to a human resources job after derogatory text messages were discovered. Page had already left. Strzok was recently escorted from the FBI building as his disciplinary process winds through the system, his lawyer has said. He also lost his security clearance. That attorney said last week that Strzok was willing to testify before any congressional committee that invited him. But the House Judiciary Committee became impatient when the anti-Trump agent dragged his feet on setting a specific date. Ultimately committee members issued an order for him to appear on June 27. Trump has blasted Strzok as a sick loser and expressed shock that the FBI was still paying him a salary. I am amazed that Peter Strzok is still at the FBI and so is everybody else that read that report, the president said after Dodge Inspector General Michael Horowitz released his findings. Peter Strzok should have been fired a long time ago and others should have been fired, he added. Horowitz wrote that Strzok's texting conduct cast a cloud over the FBI's actions. But he cautioned that he found no hard not evidence to connect the political views expressed in these messages to the specific investigative decisions.